Hi guys and welcome to Royal Vibes. Prince William enraged by the crown's showing of all-out war between Charles and Diana. The controversial Netflix series The Crown is set to be released its fifth season on November 9, which will cover the turmoil of the first half of the 1990s ending in 1996. So guys, before we get right into the full story, please do ensure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Turn on the post bell notification to always stay notified whenever I post a new video. Consider liking the video and please watch right up to the very end. Series 5 will largely focus on the breakdown of the marriage between Princess Diana and the then Prince Charles, which will include a controversial panorama interview report claim. It will also see the end of Prince Andrew's marriage to Sarah Ferguson and Princess Anne's marriage to Mark Phillips. Diana's interview with disgraced journalist Martin Bashi was found to have increased Diana's paranoia after it was concluded that Bashi used deceitful methods and breached BBC guidelines to scoop an interview with the princess. The then Princess of Wales famously said in that interview that there were three of us in her marriage to Charles. The teaser clip of the series shows Dominic West playing Charles and Diana, played by Elizabeth Debicki, preparing for their bombshell television interviews about their marriage. The clip features the voice of a fictional television reporter calling the situation all out war as Charles' interview with Jonathan Dembele covers the moment he admitted to his affair with Camilla Parker Bowles. At the time of the revelations of the Bashi interview with Diana, Prince William publicly spoke about how you know the upsetting realities of the scandal. A source close to the Prince of Wales told the Telegraph that the Prince had made his feelings very, very clear about it, and that the Crown's deprecation will be met with in the way you expect. In May 2021, William issued a personal statement from Kensington Palace to condemn the interview in which he said the interview should never be aired again. He noted that there was no legitimacy to the interview which brought him on the indesirable sadness um, knowing that it contributed to his mother's sense of fear, paranoia and isolation. Palace sources, of course, have suggested that William feels the streaming platform is you know, profiteering from the dramatization and exploitation of his mother's struggles. The Director General of the BBC, Tim Davey, vowed that the Panorama interview would not be aired again on the BBC in part of or in full. He also issued an apology to Charles, William and Prince Harry for the way in which Princess Diana was deceived and the subsequent impact of all their lives. The palace will be preparing to be rocked by the upcoming series given the impact it was previously had on the reputation and popularity of certain members of the royal family, notably the new king. A friend of Charles told the Telegraph that the crown is exploitative and Netflix has no qualms about managing people's reputations. However, when the crown began, its creators vowed that it was not presenting itself as a, doc a docu-series and the viewers understand it is not really reality, a notion which has been contradicted by the backlash directed towards the firm since the, st the series aired. So guys, to that, we have come to an end of this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. Until next time, bye-bye.